Sarah and I'm a Schools Liaison Officer for the Marketing Team here at Bang University. Today I'm going to give you a tour of some of our accommodation, so follow me. So usually you get a key card to let yourselves in, okay, very secure, it's only whoever lives in the building that can get into the building with that card and it's only the eight that live in the flat that can get into this door here. So I'll take you straight through to the kitchen. Okay, so as I already mentioned, it's usually eight to a flat. Um, some of our flats do accommodate six, and that's because um, if we have disabled students that might need a bigger room, then we can accommodate for that. Um, so as you can see, the kitchen, um, we have two sinks, two hobs, a cooker, a fridge, a freezer, recycling bins, Got a social area here with sofas and a table and a dining table and chairs here to eat your dinner. Um, microwave, kettle and toaster are supplied for you. Um, I'm afraid you can't bring these with you unless they are pub tested just for health and safety reasons. The cleaners come in once a week. They don't wash it for you, you have to do that yourself. Um, so what they tend to do, if you do see any dishes on the side, they just move them onto the dining table. They'll clean the sinks down, they'll wash down the surfaces, the hobs, they'll mop the floors in here and they'll hoover the corridor as well. I'm afraid you have to clean your own room, okay? There's an ironing board supplied for you, um, but you need to bring your own iron if you are going to venture and do some ironing. And then the bins and recycling bins get emptied um, around every other day, um, so you don't need to worry about that. So now I'll take you to see a standard room. So as I've already mentioned, it's very secure. Um, it's only you that can get into your room with this key. There's plenty of storage here. Um, you can see that you've got a wardrobe and there's a shelf inside the wardrobe. You have three drawers beside your desk, okay? You have your own chair that's supplied for you. And there's also a drawer under the bed if you need extra storage. Also, the bathroom, which includes a toilet, a sink, and a shower in there for you as well. And now I'll show you one of our bigger rooms. So as you can see, the only difference is the floor space. The wardrobe, the bed, the drawers, the desk, that's all the same size and the bathroom is. There's 24 hours, seven days a week security um, at the village. So if you do have any problems or concerns, you can just go straight up um, to their lodge. Okay, so you've seen Freeloy, so now I'm going to show you the St Mary's Village. There's a wide range of accommodation available here at St Mary's, but today I'm just going to show you a flat um, which five people would share. So here is the social space, and I'll take you through to the kitchen now. So as I've already mentioned, five people would share these facilities and this kitchen. St Mary's has been here, well, been open since 2015, um, so you can see it's fairly modern, okay? Kitchen's a little bit narrower than the Frillo site. You get one hob, one cooker, there's some bar stores, and again, the microwave, toaster, and kettle is supplied here for you. And as I've already mentioned, please don't bring these with you unless they've had tested. Okay, so if you want to follow me, I'll show you one of the rooms that we have here. One of our rooms here at St Mary's and it's an ensuite room. Bit of a bonus here, the beds are a little bit bigger, they are four foot beds here at St Mary's, they're single beds up on the frillies. You get a desk, plenty of shelf storage, drawers and there's also a wardrobe as well. There's also under bed storage as well so there's plenty of room here for all your stuff. 